So I was going to do uh, a look at the Mini T. That's what I was going to do um, for, for today's video. But then I came home from work this morning and um, came in here. And then obviously while I was in here, the old postman had been and bring a little parcel. Which I wasn't expecting just yet, but <clears throat> it has turned up. So, as you can see... It's just come and I've removed the sticker so you can't see my address because I'm smart like that. So it's on the bottom as well, so I won't be showing you the bottom. But um, yeah, and I know I've opened it up because I didn't know what it was because I wasn't expecting it. But now I know what it is. I haven't got it out of the box yet. I've just peered inside. That's what I've done. I've just peered inside and on. Oh, that's interesting. Now, what it is, is it's another drone. It's another quadcopter. Because uh, I have one somewhere in the loft, and I was going to get it down, um, strap the GoPro to it, and do some flying about. But then when I was looking on eBay, I was just bored. And I come across, and they do some very, very cheap ones. And when you look at the footage on YouTube, they seem fairly good for the money. And the camera is supposed to be HD as well. I don't think it is HD, but it's fairly good quality. So... When you buy it from this particular seller on eBay, they say, because it comes from Hong Kong, you see, um, they don't like sending it in the original packaging, apparently. So what they do is they take it out of the original packaging <coughs> and um, take it out of the original packaging and put it in a box because they reckon it's uh, safer to ship it. So anyway, we'll see what happens because I haven't looked at it yet. I don't even know what it's like, so you're going to be there. These unboxing videos appear to be quite popular, so I thought I'd jump on the bandwagon and do an unboxing video, which I don't normally do. So, what we've got in here? We've got a nice, well packaged um, box. This appears to be the drone itself, or quadcopter, whatever you want to call it. It's got no propellers or props or anything on it yet. Looks like you have to put them on yourself. Don't know quite where they are. <coughs> In this one we've got the remote, uh, yeah, that's just a remote in there, we'll have a look at that in a minute. Uh, got a bag of bits, this must be the props, propellers, uh, guards and everything else, what you need to put it together. And then, then we just got some instruction manuals. That's all we've got in there, some instruction manuals after that. So, we'll put that aside. Uh, we'll open the, the bag of bits later on. Let's have a look at the remote. I think the remote is fairly interesting, so let's have a look at that. They have packaged it quite well, so to be fair to them, because I, I messaged them and I said, I want it to be sent in the original box, please, because I want the original box. They said, no. Simple as that. We won't send it. And I said, oh, well, all right. As long as it gets to me in a fairly safe and uh, undamaged condition, I'm happy. So, what do we have here? We have a remote control, a radio control. It's got uh, little foam protective things on it, so that it doesn't get damaged in transit. And, um, yeah, it looks like just a fairly standard, they're not real buttons, by the way. They look like buttons, but they're not, they're not real. I think that's real. Um, I'm going to have to put some batteries in it. I've got some batteries somewhere. So, it's just a fairly standard um, control. I already know how it works because I've had a look on YouTube. Um, but that's your, you know, your acceleration and stuff, and uh, side to side slewing or whatever you want to call it. I don't know what they call it in the old quadcopter world. And uh, that one moves around around like that. And uh, I believe this is the. Uh, video button you press when you want to do video in and don't have this yet I'll find out later on so yeah we've got a fairly good remote I'm fairly happy with that, that radio control <coughs> for the money that's a fairly good quality um, radio control you know what I mean because these ain't mega money you know? I think it was about 30 quid um, I ordered it well I think I ordered it just after Christmas just after Christmas I ordered it a couple of days after Christmas day I ordered this and I, I'm pretty sure. And um, today is the is there 33 days in January. 
Should be the thirty first or the first. I don't know. I, I'm no good at these uh, month stuff. Anyway, so yeah, we got the remote. We we'll put that there for decoration. <coughs> now, let's have a look at the thing itself. Now, so it's quite a little bit smaller than what I was expecting. I was expecting it to be a bit bigger than what it is, but oh, I don't know. I'm no expert on quad coppers. If this is any good, I'm going to get myself a phantom, one of them phantoms. If you don't know what one of them is, look them up on YouTube or look on eBay. YouTube's probably the best bet because then you can see what they're actually like. But um, yeah, I'm going to save up a little bit and get myself a phantom. It's about three days' work, but I'll get myself a phantom. So. I wonder what it would be like to fly in the garden. I might have a little fly in the garden. Oh, that's not a very good start. One of the little lights has come off. Better put that back on. Oh, there we go. I wonder if that's how it goes. I don't know. Right, <coughs> well, it's there. So, there we go. That's what we've got. We've got ourselves a little quadcopter or a drone, whichever you prefer. And you can see there what the um, make and model is of which it is. Um, it's very light. I do like the lightweightness of it. Um, whether it's going to be overtaken by wind or not is another matter. Um, I would expect it probably will do. <coughs> the only downside of these ones, as I noticed when I was looking at the specification, is they have geared, they've got gears there for the propellers. Gears, it's very old technology having the gears. I don't think that's, um, you know, it's nowhere near new technology. But oh, it does come with an SD card as well. I forgot to mention that. It comes with a fairly, <laughs> fairly generic two gigabyte um, micro SD card, which is, um, well, we'll find out how good it is um, later on. But if they give it to you with it, you would hope that it would work fairly well with it, wouldn't you? You wouldn't think they would give you one that doesn't work with it because that would be fairly pointless and they would get a lot of complaints. So, we've got the thing itself. we put that in the background there for more decoration. Oh, and the camera. It's a nice little camera. Um, it's supposed to be HD. Whether it is HD or not, I don't know. But I will put a video up of it with some footage um, later on today and uh, we'll see what it comes out like. So now, we've got the bag of bits, this should contain the propellers, the battery for the thing itself and <coughs> whatever else, maybe some spares, I don't know, I'm not an expert on these things, so we'll find out, put it in a nice bag anyway, definitely not going to fall out of there, that's for sure, alright, what have we got here then, blimey, lots of propellers, um, some cables. Oh, we've got a little SD micro SD reader for the um, micro SD card. That'll ever focus. I wonder if I do this and not focus now. A little bit. Yeah, we've got a little micro SD card reader. Um, that's the charging cable for the battery, I believe. Got some screws in there and a screwdriver. So, that's what we've got in there. We've got loads of propellers, all the same. Just got a little warning thing on them. Do not fly with broken or damaged propellers. May cause damage or lead to injury. Lovely. Like, I really wanted to know that. So, we seem to have some spares. This, um, propellers, we've got loads of them. M many more than four, as we need. <coughs> um, and... Some guards. Oh, the battery must already be in there. It must be because it's heavy. Um, landing feet, I believe. More landing feet. And the um, propeller guards. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put it together, and then we're going to have a jump cut, and we'll come to it, put together. <laughs> 